Welcome back everyone to some more Alter Ego. So let us see if we can get that dagger now. It's nice that they chucked the scoundrel out, but it's not solved my problem with the grave digger. Well, well, well. The gentleman has forgotten something here. Are you going to take it or am I going to take it? There we go. Yeah. It's mine There's now. There's nothing like an honest day's work. At last I feel like a human being again. Now you have a knife. Okay. So I'm guessing we were never meant to get the watch back because that was too easy. Therefore, we execute the other plan of getting the rope. Come on, dude. Faster. Mush. Jimau. This is what I'm thinking. We get the ropes, we can use that to climb up. Well, that's good. So we need the ropes so we can climb up, and I assume we can't use a knife to cut the beef. We need the cleaver. When I did this last time, in the ship's kitchen, they caught me. Oh, sweet. Okay. Now we have some meat. And I think that's all we can interact with. I just want to. I'm so hungry, I'd eat. The but not with my teeth. Do you want to get some more? I don't want any more. Come on. You want something to eat? Do you want to eat it? Hum num 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 num. Looks like a leg. Oh. Did I just accidentally combine the thing? Great. Now it's perfect. I could go catching sharks with this. No, I didn't think you could do. Would do that, but right on. So my idea was slightly off. Well, that's all right with me. Let's go back to the graveyard and see what we can do about that paving, a cobblestone. So, I assume we need to use the knife to get that out as well. Hey, buddy. Oh, he's looking at me. Look at that. That's so cute. Thank God we can get it out. This was easy, like a hot knife through butter. Okay. <laughs> what do you say? So I want to see if I can use this there. Maybe it'll die of hunger. It'll be safer. Huh. Even if I tied it. The dog would eat it in several seconds, which still wouldn't be enough time to climb over the wall and make my escape. Hmm, okay. Let's go into the gas lamp and see what we can do with this rock. One slash and the work will be done. Slash? Damn work. It can't be true. <laughs> At last, I was near to giving up. Oh. Gas is a good ally, silent and reliable. Oh, we're gonna get the doggy over here so he falls asleep slash dies. Oh, oh man! I should let you starve, you bastard. But this will be a faster way. So, come on, That's take it. Terrible! I thought we were just going to distract and not kill the poor thing. No, doggy! It's a trap! Don't do it! Oh gosh, he's going to inhale so much gas. And... Oh. Sleep well. Poor oh, doggy! Oh well. <laughs> Let's scale that gate. I also need to do something else. Doggy's gone, you can do it. Everything's okay. Nobody in sight. Jump it. Go on. Yeah. I'm so glad I don't have to do anything myself. Mash A and D or something. Okay. No living soul in here. Apart from the gravekeeper. 
dead tree, ground, church, check everything else, just a dead tree, dead tree, and that's it. An ideal place for leaving a message, but I can't see anything. Think you found a source of light then? Uh, probably. Nothing. Are you sure? Right, so we got into the church. Let's go to... I assume that leads back outside to the gate, so we'll go around the church. Actually no, let's just go into the church. It's Davis, probably locked anyway. What do they know about life? I've never trusted much. them, and Brian wouldn't go there either. Hmm. That's why we did it, because I assumed it would be locked, but he's... Assuming Brian wouldn't go there. That's all you can do, just another... Come on, faster. Mush, chitty-wow! Brian! 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 Oh, God. <laughs> I didn't think he was going to shout out. Brian! Um, oh. Ghosts! Oh, jeez, run, dude, run. Ghosts are coming. What the oh. hell was that? I almost filled my pants. I should I know. I wasn't paying attention. Do we go back then? I'm not going to go there. My knees are still shaking like a jelly. Oh, jeez, dude. Come on. Stop being a, a wuss. <sighs> what now? I'm not going to go there. What do you want me to do? You went there, you got scared and just left. <laughs> Pull out your knife then. Go on. Don't be a wuss. Pull out your corkscrew. Get get some buttons and throw. Yare yare. Maybe this isn't the exit then. Ah, oh. Brian. Is it you? Man, I've been looking for you for ages. God, he looks terrible. Oh no, Brian's drunk. Oh my god, he's drunk! I tell you, <laughs> Jesus Christ! <laughs> okay, that did startle me. <laughs> you jackass! I thought you were dead. Take it mm. easy, Tim. I'm okay, but you're a bit pale. Damn, Brian! I'm chasing after you in pubs and cemeteries, and you're merrily sleeping here, like a log. You know me, once asleep, I'm like a corpse. I'm glad to see you. Glad to see you too, you fool. What are you waiting for? Sit down. Did the gravedigger hound you or what? Don't frighten me. How did you get here? I have my ways. Did you have any trouble? Ah, nothing I couldn't manage. I knew I could rely on you. Nonetheless, you should be glad it's quiet today. Adieu, Jack wouldn't niggle with us. You can trust me. Adieu, Jack. That sounds familiar. You won't know him. He's a real butcher. The leader of a local gang. The cemetery's their territory, but they've already cleaned it twice this week. So they won't bother today. They said they were going today. That's it. He was going to launch another crackdown. Are you sure? Absolutely. He was talking to a brainless gorilla. He told him to get hold of the others, and that they'd meet in an hour. And when was that? They're already late. Damn. Come on, we're out of here. It's not worth the risk. Let's go, Brian. Come on. Hurry up, we're getting out. You can count on that. I'm not staying another second. There's a, we can go for a walk. Anyway. 
Let's go that way. Where has he gone? Oh, we did we lose him? Climb up, Tim. What are you waiting for? Oh God, Brian. You sleep here like a baby all night, and now it's like the place is on fire. I'll be right there. Climb up. Okay, but buck up. I'll tear him to pieces one day. Mm. I don't want to end up here. Certainly not. Let's it's climb too up. High for me. Has Brian learned to fly? Are you. It's too high for me. You, you. I've escaped from an orphanage, a jail, a ship, and now a cemetery. Like, are you really something new? gonna do this to me? Where's Brian? He can help you. I wonder how much it hurts to be burnt to ashes. Come on, dude. Anyway, if I don't get out of here now, I'll find out what it's like to have a knife stabbed in my stomach. Yeah, we don't want that, do we? But you're not giving much choice, are you? What else can we... Tombstone. Use a tombstone. I, I don't really care. Oh, twats. Go around. Blasted stonemasons, idiots. Okay, uh. Can we still use it? Over. No! We can use the fountain! Come on! Why it's do just you... a wreck. I could hurt myself. There's gonna be more than that to hurt you when they come for you. What, do we have to go back then? Really? Oh jeez. Well, I have to find another way out because this guy's an idiot. Why? Oh, do we use the bench? As I always say, anything unbolted will be stolen sooner or later. So why should I leave it here for someone else? Dex a bench. Well, but where should this go? That way. Take it to the graves. It'll be an awful chore to pull it aside. So let's get down to work. Come on. Go. God knows how much I hit physical. <laughs> You've done a fair bit of it lately, my friend, so. The fun's over. Someone's coming. I won't wait for him. Get up the damn wall then! You can get stabbed, aren't you? Come on, buddy. Get over the freaking wall. We don't want to die. Oh, thank god. Floating feet. Epic. What were you doing there? I almost took roots here. <laughs> Do you think I can fly or what? There was a time you'd climb it like an ape. I haven't forgotten it yet. Yeah, well, there was a time you'd bet for your pal. What are you talking Snap. about? We're still pals. You better tell me where we're going. We can chat later. Come on, let's go. I know the perfect place to hide. You'll be surprised. A smart word at last. I have to find a place to hide and plan what I'll do next. What are we doing exactly? I he's going to get the money for the tickets to America. That's right. And we'll need something to start us off. But maybe I'm worrying about nothing. He wouldn't have written to me if he hadn't an ace up his sleeve. Are you we sure? We the town red, just like we did in the old days. Together again. Yeah. Damn, where has he got to? <laughs> Stop talking to yourself so much then. Keep losing him. 13th of November, 1894. I don't know which good fairy is with me, but the resolution of the drowned dressmaker's case has opened a new door for me. A transfer, my own office in Plymouth, and possible promotion. I hope this will be a good start to a successful career. The 13th of November. Fortunately, I'm not superstitious. Hmm. Here we are, then. sir. 
This is for you. Thank you very much. Have a good day, sir. It feels like a dream. I've been waiting for this moment for three whole years. Three whole years. And on that note, we're going to wait a bit longer as we will see you in the next episode, guys. See you then. Bye.